Now let's create a Dr. X loop layer. So I'm going to right click on a blank space on the rack and select Dr. X loop player. The Dr. X loop player is an instrument that will play loops from the Reason Factory Sound Bank or loops that you create using Recycle, which is another program used for creating loops that is made by Propeller Heads, the manufacturer of Reason. When we first launch the Dr. X, we need to load a loop. Let's click on Browse Loop, indicated by the folder icon. Let's go to the Reason Factory Sound Bank. And as you can see, we have Dr. X drum loops, Dr. X instrument loops, and Dr. X percussion loops. Let's first try Dr. X drum loops. Let's go to the glitch folder, and let's try Mangle Beat 85. We can preview the loop by clicking on Preview. Let's copy that loop to the sequencer. We would click the Dr. X in the sequencer, click on the Dr. X, then edit, copy loop to track. Okay, let's take a look and listen. Okay, let's say we didn't like that loop. We could highlight the MIDI information in the sequencer and simply hit delete. We could go back into Browse Loop, go to the Reason Factory Sound Bank. Let's go back into Dr. X Drum Loops, and let's try the House Folder this time. And let's try the Congress Loop. Remember, we can preview that by clicking on Preview. Okay, I like that loop a little bit better. Let's try that one. So we'll click on the Dr. X in the sequencer again, click on the Dr. X, and a different way to add the tracks to the sequencer is to simply click on to track. Okay, now let's take a look and listen. Okay, I think that loop works a little better for us, so we'll stick with that one for now.